everyone, my name is Idil and welcome to my kitchen. In this video, we are going to make a dish that I absolutely love, which is salmon tartare. It's a dish that we usually eat at restaurants, but it's super, super simple to prepare at home and it would be a great appetizer to serve in front of like a fish or meat or some pasta. And it's really so simple that you can prepare it in like in 10 minutes. Well, it will need to wait a little bit uh, for marinade, but you don't have a lot of active time where you have to cut and do stuff. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to zest the lemons. You can do one lemon zest, one orange zest, however you like, or you can even do lime. I'm going to use the zest of two lemons. I want it nice and citrusy and fresh. So that's one. And I'm going to juice them as well. So juice of two lemons. And the acidity of the lemon will in a way cook the salmon. So yes, this is a dish where the fish is raw. But because of the lemon, it won't hurt your stomach. Now I'm going to add in one clove of garlic, which I've minced. I'm just adding a little bit. A little bit goes a long way when making salmon tartare. And I'm adding some salt, giving everything a good mix and getting my olive oil in here. So I'm going to transfer about two thirds of this sauce onto my salmon here. I have about 400 grams and that's about enough. And the remaining I'm leaving for the avocado and mango, which I'll use up while plating this up. And now I'm going to cover this up with some cling film. Transfer it to my fridge and it will wait for about 25 minutes and I will continue. The salmon waited in the fridge for nearly 30 minutes. And as you can see, it started to change its color. It started to become whiter as if it's been cooked. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some sesame seeds in there. I'm not going to toast them because I don't want their aroma too strong. So I'll say about a full teaspoon. I'm going to give everything a good mix. And that's perfect. So now let's assemble this. I have one avocado, a soft avocado. I'm going to dice it. I want everything about the size of salmon, maybe a little smaller. Get them into my bowl here. So as you remember we had some leftover sauce here, I'm adding about two-thirds of this to my avocados, giving everything a good mix. And you can kind of mash it up as well, it doesn't have to be perfectly diced. So I have a ring, I'm going to put the ring on my plate, I'm going to get in a layer of avocados in here, I'm going to sauce up the mangoes as well, I'm going to get in a layer of mangoes on top of the avocados. And I'm adding this some salmon. And some chives. And that's it. I'm going to give it a taste. It's very fresh, it's very filling, it's very delicious. Do try and you won't regret. I hope to see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye bye.